Hello. So it has been a hot minute um, since really at the time. Um, busy week for personal reasons. But I'm going to make some time to try and follow up on some card reviews and also uh, the book example stuff because the and maybe a little bit of writing because the book stuff is like really really close to having the chapter done but until the chapter's done done like the editor can't really take a look at it so we want to get from really really close to ready for the editor um, and code reviews like we just don't want people to block on us even though that's something that frankly happens all the time um, that's just like and let's get some music going. Alexa, turn on Holden's speakers. Um, can we do... What's some good music for us to get on today? Um, uh, I want to find a little... Um, okay, um, Techno Axe Lo Fi. Um, it's not actually by Techno Axe. Uh, sorry, give us a second to find the music. Um, Four minutes though. I don't. Let's go find techno at on YouTube. We'll find another playlist and we'll just get that rocking. Okay. Uh, let's go playlist. That's what we got. Um, house trap late beats glitch hop. I'm feeling like tired. Synthwave. Fuck yeah. <clears throat> that's that's the vibe for, for right now. Speaking of, Alexa, create a 35 minute timer. Alexa, create a 35 minute timer. Let's go. Terminal view, which is not actually a terminal view. Um, do -do -do uh, do -do -do hmm. uh, do -do -do uh, uh, and catch up. Uh, it looks like my the thing that I added. Um, I tried adding a, a filter to this. Oh, wait. Let's do that. Uh, we want to go noise suppression. Add that. And there we go. Okay, cool. Um, let's see if the noise suppression filter works better. Better, better. For a short screen, cool. Okay, and then we go here, go here, we go here. Fantastic. Okay. Um. So. Uh, yeah, let's let's go through go through the things that we've been mentioning on GitHub. Uh, so the one that I was dealing with right beforehand was this issue that I raised um, from one of our previous streams, actually. And it was like, hey, this thing is weird and it's not behaving as I expected. Fantastic Nike folks were like, cool, let's look on, work on this. And then they were like, hey, this is how it works. Um, that's why it wasn't working. And it's like, that's cool, but that's confusing to me. Um, and so my, my answer is like, hey, this is confusing. 
but I think like one of these two things might be good, um, which is like update the docs and add an error message uh, so that it's clear what's going on. Yeah. Or, you know, um, just just run them anyways, because like I, I don't super get why it's implemented this way. Very well could be could be a solid reason. Okay. Um, okay, cool. So this has code review comments. Um, and it is failing in CI. Let's go ahead and take a look at what it's failing on. Um, C test results. Yes, that is what I would like. Hmm. Okay. Um, yeah, cool. Looks, so we'll go back here, go back here, go back here. Um, and we'll leave a comment. Yeah, uh, looks like it's failing uh, from uh, Scala style checks. Um, new uh, fix the style of feed. Can you get a chance? Cool. Um, and so it's just a, like, hey. This is, we can't really do much, but whatever. Uh, let's go ahead and close that. Um, this. Pretty sure this got merged, even though it shows the not merged symbol. That's how it shows up in Spark, because we use some weird custom merging script. I love this one. I want to see it through. Let's go take a look what anyone else said. Um, okay. Ah. Right. Uh, but it's, it's a warning message. Uh, so if the user is doing it intentionally, uh, they can ignore the warning. Uh, they can ignore the warning. Cool. Sounds great. So, uh, no other comments. No one. Uh, let's take a look at. I want to make sure. Okay, yeah. CloudFan reviewed this uh, a long time ago. Um, but their their issue has been addressed. So we get to merge this PR. That brings me great joy. Um, in part because it's like also not all that much work compared to the rest of my life. Um, ooh. Uh, what branch am I on? Oh. Okay, I don't know. Uh, why is this not? Uh, uh, oh, wait, eh, whatever. Um, it reset Apache GitHub master cool great now dev merge spark pr um don't want this to automatically talk to Jira anyways. Uh, so I don't want to accidentally stream my Jira. Let's do, stream my password. Let's go take a look, make sure the Jira matches. Uh, oh, we can close developer tools. Yep. 
I love this. Is that gonna work? I don't think so. Yeah, okay. Okay, and then we need this one. Did that actually autofill or did it get overwritten by the fucking I feel like it's getting overwritten. So assign to Gia Ben. Fantastic. Loop. Great. Yep. Here. Cool. So that should be resolved. Resolve issue, target version four, fixed version 4.0. Resolved. Love it. Hmm. Ah, that's you know what that's that's a ah uh, yeah okay merged uh, to the current grant so could be in four. Yep. Great. Okay. Um. Done, backports fixed, fantastic, love it, love it. And uh, this one, uh, list tag needs to save two expressions separately because the expressions used for aggregation. Uh, hmm. Hmm. Huh. Eh, let's see what Believer says. I don't, I don't have to put that context on the sorting um, there. So, uh, okay, cool. Now, that's good. I uh, guess 15 minutes of like code review stuff. Oh, right, Spark Docker. Mm. Oh, okay. Hmm. Eh. This looks to be well in hand. Um, because. Wait, what? Let's go take a look at these files changed. Uh, uh, what? Uh, 
Uh, uh, gotcha. Okay. Okay. Um, okay. Makes sense to me. So the, the should be removed is essentially because this is a list of tags and the Spark 3.5 image is going to be tagged as Scala 2.12. Um, so don't don't tag the Spark 3.4.1 as that, because otherwise we will end up overwriting tags and this is going to be like not great. Okay, cool. So um, let's go ahead. We'll plus one. Um, uh, did you would we want to do Scala 2.13 with uh, 3.5? Would we want to do the Scala 2.13 tag with 3.5 instead? Cool. Uh, all right, thanks. Oh, I the icon. Uh, hmm. uh, I mean, I don't curse me. Um, believe in God, but you know. Things you enjoy. I'm not gonna yuck your yum. Okay, let's see here. What am I doing? Um, do, 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 spark. Oh, right, okay. So, um, let's do the writing thing. That's going to be testing and validation. And we're going to go find our note about uh, the Nike one. Update that. Oh yeah, okay. Um oof. uh we'll fix this. Okay. Um summary statistics, here we go. Uh okay. Well, let's try and fix um Um, oh yeah, okay, uh, okay, cool, yeah, we can drop this, this warning, um, um, Also write um, what's it called? Uh, summary stats rules with uh, Spark citations. Currently, uh, Spark expectations will only run uh, summary rules if there are also row rules um, on the same table slash. 
uh, on the same target. Let's see. Great. Okay. Fantastic. Um, let's go fix. Um, oh, cool. That worked. Uh, fantastic. Squash and merge. Confirm squash and merge. So now it's on Spark 3.5 and Iceberg 1.4. Um, what did this do? Load previous run data. Oh, okay. Hmm. <clears throat> did that not work? What fails? Uh, Python test. Um, black. Okay, black and flag eight. Okay. Um, hmm. Okay, yeah, we can fix that really quickly. I am curious. Uh, load. Like we wrote this, but did we? Uh, it's going to be load underscore. Okay, load underscore previous. No, we didn't. Okay. Um, uh, Dude, so this is which section is this? This is validate data validation. Um, accumulators. Um, input tables, output tables, counters. Ah, here we go. This is where we wanted to put it. Um, uh, in general, you likely want to use um, with uh, counter slash uh, job metric uh, validation. Um, prior to publishing. Um, um, <laughs> uh, loading the information from the previous job, uh, Spark uh, is shown in, uh, and you can then uh, use whichever data validation tool uh, you prefer. OK, uh, so we'll go ahead. Yes, load previous. Uh, um, Python. Load previous runs uh, info. This is going to be Python. Okay, Spark. Uh, okay, the thing that I want to check out is. Great. Um, there we go. Um, tags equals load. Cool. Uh, great. Let's go ahead and fix this up, shall we? Uh, 
uh, for history pass. Okay, we'll call this event log path application ID. Oh, fuck, not what I wanted. Oh, well. There we go. Now we won't go back to it. Um, Test load JSON record. Uh, magic. Great. Um, uh, Flake hate Python. Examples black Python examples. What did it say? Uh, cannot parse. Oh, oh, yeah, that's why. All right, now, hmm, that's weird. Uh, okay. Um, DI, run our test. Hmm. I need to rename this down I so that it runs, because otherwise no isn't going to discover it. Okay, we can do that. All right, and we need to rename it. Uh, load.
Hmm. Shall play test do magic. Um. Okay. I'm thirty seven. False. Um, and location error. None type object is not subscriptable. Oh, wait, what? No. Ah, uh, uh, here we go. Uh, OS dot list dir temp. Spark events. That's good. Let me look. That definitely exists. Um, oh, that's why. Okay. Okay, uh, what's it say? Um, return the last modification time of a file reported by OS stat. Oh, okay. Uh, uh, I'm the X. Okay, what is this? Um, ah, uh, never again. Temp spark events. Fantastic. Is there a like fancy? I don't. I don't actually want. Oh, there we go. Actually, fantastic. So actually, what about if we just do? Oh, uh, 
Uh, okay. That is fantastic. That's great. Dude, turn them in directories. I'm the oldest uh, Spark job since it's probably not the end of the world. Um, cool. Let's go ahead and run talks. This is reminding me of NPR's toxic, toxic asset. Hmm. Something tells me that my, my or condition isn't actually right. I just don't actually remember what that is. There we go. Uh, um, oh, we need an extra slack. Sounds good. Line break after binary operator, line 29. Okay. Uh, that's an error? Okay, I don't, why is that an error? I don't. Okay. Alexa, stop. Hmm. Yeah, this error message makes no sense. I mean, we've got a good idea of the the spark context is stop. Okay. Where is my JSON? Do magic. Okay, we're at line twenty seven. What? Why are you? What? Uh... I don't know what the content was. Oh. Okay. Mm -hmm. Oh god, this, this error message leaves a little bit to be desired. Um, so, take a look. Uh, Spark, Python, Hi Spark, SQL, Session, def load. Wait, no, oh, sorry, def read. Great, gives us back a data frame reader, which oh, nice. okay, def JSON. Yeah, that looks like a pretty valid path. Um, so why is this failing? Like, uh, why are you failing, my friend? Okay, target ID. What the hell? Okay. Yeah, this is this is line twenty seven. Read write line four eighteen. And then I mean it could be a version mismatch. Um 
Spark Home. Maryland Spark Home set. Um, I do have it installed though, so like I don't. And and we did get this like. So it's saying that we can't call methods on a stop spark context. It doesn't make a lot of sense to me because uh, I don't think but let's do this and we'll just like sort of try and see what's going on, right? Like, is the spark context actually stopped at this point? Or is it reporting that we can't call that because we're like causing it to crash? Let's go take a look. Yeah, so it has no issue with line 27. It's when we try and do this, that it's failing. That's really weird. Hmm. Okay. Hmm. Hmm. Well. Hmm. Hmm. I feel like I'm missing something. Okay, let's go ahead. Load previous run. previous run data self dot Objects. Okay. Net. Hmm. 
Pardon me, self dot session. Talks. A little bit of re -R. It's still like, what the hell? Fuck. Hmm. Oh, yeah. Um. Fantastic. Okay. So this is causing it to fail. And I don't know why. So we're just going to go ahead and we're going to like launch a normal Spark Shell. And that'll hopefully be. A little bit easier. Uh, and hopefully, there our message here will be clearer because, like, we actually have our, our logging and stuff. Okay, uh, spark dot load. Spark read. Uh, Okay, let's go. Tam Spark events, sure. That loaded just fine. That's confusing. Hmm. Okay. Filter. Yeah. Uh, oh, yeah, okay. Ah, method or class? Hmm. Hmm. That's interesting. Maybe a bug. Maybe not. Uh, let's take a look. Method or class? This is coming from... So far down, I don't actually know. Um... And hmm. yes, check high spark data frame filter or there we go. Why is this 
not. Hmm. Oh, okay. I th think this might be it. We just need to do this. Fantastic. Okay. Okay. So, like, all things considered, right, like, this looks like it should work. Let's go. Uh, It would be just fine. What happens if we give this JSON load some path that doesn't exist? That gives it the path that doesn't exist. Um, no. What is going on here, my friends? Uh, Python talks Pi Core, okay, Pi Spark. Interesting. Oh, I don't, well, hmm. Okay. Cool. Oh, maybe I have the wrong, uh, no, but the other ones are succeeding. Hmm. I don't know. Ah, here we go. Ah. Okay. Let's drop Delta Spark. What the fuck? Because, like, this is working. It's for three, three, though, I suppose. Let's go. Fine, fine. Okay. Um. Or okay. Give us working version of Spark. Um mm. 
Uh, Python paste mode. Is there? Ah, uh, IPython. And, well, let's see. No. Uh, Uh, okay. What the fuck? Okay, so this is some issue inside of talks, maybe. I don't know. Uh, or not inside of talks, like inside of our talks environment. Um, uh, yeah. Like this runs fine. So we're doing something wrong with our testing. Oh, unless we're maybe we're attaching to an old Spark session. I can see that. It's a bug, but I thought we worked around it. What? Why is it still running 3.9? Ah. Is this a... Damn it. This is a spark testing base issue. Uh, yep. Uh, collections.abc, okay. Spark testing base. Yes. This is coming from uh, unit test two. So that uh, unit test two. Uh, okay. 
I'm going to go over here. Now what I want it. Uh, Two since it does not work in modern Python. I'm going to try test instead. Great. Um, why are you still trying to use? So much, very well. Let's go take a look at this. Why is it not? Why is magic not working? Thank you. 
There we go. Simple streaming test. Ah, expected failure. Hmm. Yeah. Test is not defined. What? Uh. Mm, okay. Oh, okay. This ended up being a lot longer than planned. Uh, okay. And uh, it's going to be... Um, that's okay. Okay, looking good. Yeah, you know, it's, it's, you know, whatever. It's always yak shaving. I shouldn't say it's always yak shaving, it often is. Finish, getting rid of, doing it test two. Okay, and then, uh, no. Um, great. Okay. That's fantastic. Now, uh, published by, I never, it's been so long. I want to say it's Twine is the one that I use. Twine. Oh, fantastic. Uh, which Python? Python? Hmm. Uh, pip uninstall Twine. Pretty sure it is. Pip install fine. Uninstall fine. Uh, Um, 
define upload check register. Let's just twine upload. Okay, let's go to. Hmm, let's see here. I probably need two factor auth. I don't need it yet. Okay. We should fix that. I will deal with that another time, which doesn't involve me um, streaming my two factor auth. Cool. Great. Okay. Fantastic. So now we can come back over here. And then we can go into Python. Spark testing. No, okay. Uh, talks to I and I. Spark testing base greater or equal to 0.11. Okay. Hmm. Run talks again. How long have we been doing this? An hour. Okay, we'll give it. We'll give it another two, three minutes. Um, Why is this still failing? Like, this is very confusing to me because it works when I use it outside. And we have multiple tests that pass. So I don't get it. Hmm. Um, hang on, okay. What's here? Hmm. Oh, actually, wait, no. Uh, don't need that. Um, well, do we? up a load previous run a bit. Drop large target size EX. Um, I still don't know why it's not working in talks, but it is working outside of talks. And that frustrates me. Um, that's pretty normal, I guess. Uh, okay. Log. Is that right? So, no. Next question. 
Name hit checkout dash B. Spark expectations fix. So what they said was Third thing. Okay, cool. And then if we go in for here, Python examples. Ah, uh, third. Okay, now we've got both present, and it should work. Let's run that example while we're here. So uh, we run we run this and now it says final row query so local third fake final ag dq run status So that works now. Okay, cool. Uh, cool. Can't do this very well. All right. Uh, function check fail local and code. This is actually hmm. Wait, what? 
More than one row returned by a subquery. You ah, fantastic! Found a bug. Found a bug. Uh, Etsy underscore complex. Uh, one minute more. Hmm. Fantastic. I am feeling good about this. Not like fantastic, but like good, good. Like this is this is uh, pretty good progress, I would say. Cool. Um, oh wait. Um. Hmm. Yeah. Um. Ooh, okay, this uh, uh, Nike Spark expectations. Um, it's probably most, not mostly. Some of them are reported by me. Um, here we go. This was an enhancement, and then we closed it. Um, And then this is not not working so good. Um, so I just uh, redid this. Um, let's see. So I just redid this uh, without the or or. Still has the or, but exits uh, with the same error code. Don't fail. Uh, file. Uh, and I checked by uh, executing a non zero exit. Uh, but the aggregate rule. Failed, and, but um, did it with a row DQ and a tag DQ rule, and uh, let's go ahead fail. Um, and it did not work. Uh, C, uh, SE underscore complex, so for example, slash, uh, minute 85 in, do 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 Cool. But this is good. Um, this is, this is really good. Um, It's actually going to be an empty file. Uh, add a row DQ rule to SE complex so that the ag DQ uh, can execute. Cool. Fantastic. I'm going to go ahead and raise a PR for that. Um, cool, this will take a minute. Um, this is not still failing. What's failing? Running talks. Plate eight failed. What? I mean, 
Hmm. Okay. Let's go ahead and previous run data. Okay. Okay, we're also going to ignore 5 out of 3, but I don't care. Broke. Anything that we can fix quickly and easily. And uh, Pi 310 is the one that's. Oh! Oh! Interesting. Okay. Ugh. about if um, Cool. Okay, we're going to call it because that's been an hour and a half, which is a good length of time for me, honestly, about half, half an hour longer than we normally go. Um, and about an hour longer than I intended to go tonight uh, because we ended up shaping a yak, which is getting a Spark testing base, Python version to work with Python 3.10 and probably 3.11 too. Not a big deal because most of the users for Spark testing base are Scala, but it's 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 a good thing to do. Um, we didn't bother with this before because Spark didn't party very well with 3.10, but in 3.5 it does. So, um, that's great. Thank you all for joining. Um, Gallon, thanks for saying hi. I'll see you all around. Um, stay as safe as possible out there.